It's all Melbourne jumpers back there. Jeff White, Carroll protecting Ferguson. They tried to sort themselves out, but they didn't get it sorted. They didn't count on Steve Johnson. And he wastes no time. Perhaps hurries it a bit, but he finds Kelly. <laughs> They're finding it hard to keep their footing out there. Oh. Oh. Maloney just crunching. Oh. Really lifting play. Kent Kingsley doesn't go for goal because Cameron Ling's on the scene. Oh, oh he spilled a plump pun. It's just about outside the Geelong goal square. Rook, Ling, a chance to make amends. Now Rigoni allowed to play on. He drives it long towards full fort. Robertson at the back. It's that Scarlett. He's got a great strike rate. Kick seven last time these sides played. And he's on the board at the MCG. Boundary throw in, Mooney, edged out wide, he can run in and kick an open goal, Cam Mooney, and he does! Play fair, off to Rook, the initial fumbles, hurting both sides, Gary Ablett, a short ball handler, trust his instincts, <laughs> and the instincts are good! Get excited! <laughs> Holland. Gampo going to do here on five goals. Steve Johnson again then. Whitey is getting a little bit hot under the collar. Norman must respond. Can he set Davy away? Davy, can he control it? Now he puts on the afterburner from 40 metres. He kicks and he goes. Great stuff, Aaron Davy. It's a nice. He's got blistering speed and he does it very well. And well done in turn by Will. But it's Bill Stramler from 40. He kicks and he goes. He missed the mark, Gardner, cleverly to Riccardi. Glides through the middle of the MCG, got a bit overconfident, but he got out of trouble. Found Nathan Applett, the mark paid. An ambitious kick in the middle of three demons. It'll end up in a Geelong score. A question of accuracy for Cameron Lang, there's no question now. Bangs the way to the top of the goal square. Holland at the back. Oh, that's a big grab. Big mark from Ben Holland. He had the set, he had the run. Neil Danaher has switched it up. Oh, you can't do that. Well, you can apparently. Kingsley takes the rook interception and sends him to full fire. What's he doing there? Matthew Scarlett. Nah, he won't be at full forward, Malcolm. Sorry. Oh, on one kick. <laughs> <laughs> Drives it long to the goal square. Nathan Ablett. Can't take the mark. At the four, Mackie can snap a goal. Here's another opportunity for them. Oh, Rigoni hit hard by Johnson. Rigoni's down. Bang. Oh, that was... Uh, I think he was a bit uh, out to it there. 19 at quarter time, 37 at half time. Oh, gee, that's, that is... That is very ugly. Let's hope he's OK because he almost copped the full force of the Stephen King boot there. Oh, gee. Chris, so we're sitting 100 metres away from that, and we could hear the sound of that boot made on Jeff White's phone. So I don't come any easier than this for Aaron Davey. Maybe he can get something started for the Melbourne side. Oh, oh. no, he can't. Well, that just about sums up the day. <laughs> That's got some people pretty happy. Linking hand ball, Gary Ablett now. 50 from goal. Great chase from Davey, but Ablett loads up. Inspiring stuff from the little champ. Stand up and play in that sort of role. Sanderson, his career will extend at least another week. Play fair. The bearded cat <laughs> goes back to Mackey. 17 8 Geelong on the board. <laughs> and there you go. Comes back to Ferguson. Takes two teams. Yeah, they have been good, that's for sure. It's going to be a Harley free kick. Now, the last thing Geelong want to do is do something stupid. Well, they said they're going to get Steve Johnson off the ground. Hallelujah! <laughs> Siren sounds. A resounding win for the Cats. 18 8 1 16. And they set up a semi final clash with the Sydney Swans. 9 7 61 for Melbourne.